Today I'm trying out this HO scale Polar Express model uh, from Lionel. This one it's uh, DCC built in. Uh, I have some pros and cons about it really. Uh, the pros is it seems to run nicely enough, stays on the track, doesn't derail. I, I've heard that these can be uh, bad about derailing but seems to be okay on this Caddo track that I'm testing it with today uh, the sounds are you know they're okay they're, they're not uh, the finest uh, prototypical type sounds that you've ever heard but it's kind of a make-believe locomotive anyway this Berkshire uh, that is from the from the movie the details are are decent uh, considering that it is a uh, made after the movie they're actually i think quite good uh, it's got the little movable bell here uh, and it's got plenty of sounds so when it's at a standstill you can hit the the five key on this and you can hear various announcements of course it's going to keep repeating that one now isn't it well yeah it's going to so let's Start it moving here. See if we can get some different sounds on it. That's one of the things that I don't like, is there's no way to choose exactly which sound or announcement that you want. So uh, the bell is button one, as you'd expect. The whistle is button number two, as you'd expect. And the headlight is the uh in this case with this bachman controller it's 10 but it's it's the standard light command button uh for this particular dcc controller this is a very old uh easy dcc i think it's called easy command but this is the only one that works with this engine and that's the big complaint i have so you know i've got a really nice dcs 240 that I like to use with my DCC stuff normally. It doesn't work with this locomotive. Uh, you can't get any announcements out of it at all using that expensive DCC controller, but with this inexpensive DCC controller, <laughs> it, it works. If I press the five key on, on my, uh, my Digitrax, controller it does nothing just nothing so i'm not sure what's up with that lionel claims that this is fully nmra compliant you know i i don't really have enough expertise with dcc to say whether uh, there's something wrong with the digitrax controller or if it's something with this locomotive and the way it's designed but i can say that when I put it on the, the uh, JMRI software and tried to read the settings with JMRI, it read nothing. Everything came up completely like blank uh, as far as the sounds and other controls go. And the CV settings and stuff is like, okay, so they've got that locked down six ways to Sunday, I guess. And uh, there's not a lot you can do with it that way so that that's probably the the big complaint uh that i have with this so there's a, a decent sound there of tom hanks as the conductor so that's when it stopped it'll say these announcements hopefully we can get it to say uh the third announcement when it stopped here There you go. That's the third announcement that it does. And then once you get it rolling again, there's three other announcements that it'll do while it's rolling. Here, so we'll see if we can get it to do that. It, it's all uh, hit or miss. So there's a, uh, one of them. And there's another one, so we're getting lucky this time.
There you go. That's uh, all of the announcements that you can get by pressing the five key and it's random. You press the five key. If it's standing still, there's three random announcements you can get. And if it's rolling, there's three more random announcements you can get. And you know, no, no serious complaints. It's nice. It's a nice set. I love the cars on it. The cars are all lit with the flicker free LEDs and uh, they seem to, you know, do their job okay i mean that you can see that the the lighting is a little uneven in the cars and you know for what you pay for this set especially when you buy the extra cars it's it's pretty expensive uh overall i do like it though i like the set i think uh it, it's a nice set especially if you're going to run it at christmas uh around your tree or something like that so that's what we wanted to present today and hope you enjoyed this hope you get some good information out of it and we'll see you next time